Welcome back everyone. This video is a tribute to all the stars who created wonderful memories for us, and we honor their lasting legacy. But before we start, let me know if you recognize any of the following actors and actresses. When did you notice them for the first time and how old were you? Do you have any particularly nostalgic recollections of them? Let me know in the comments section below. Alberta Watson, born Faith Susan Alberta Watson, was a Canadian actress. She got her first role at age 19 in CBC's movie Honor Thy Father. Watson died from complications from cancer at Kensington Hospice in Toronto on March 21, 2015. Barney Martin was best known for playing Morty Seinfeld, Jerry's father, on the sitcom Seinfeld. He also played supporting roles in Mel Brooks' The Producers and Dudley Moore's Arthur. He also played the role of Amos Hart in the 1976 Broadway production of Chicago. At the age of 82, he died of bladder cancer in Studio City, Los Angeles, California. Dak Rambo, or Norman J. Rambo, was an American actor known for his roles as Walter Brennan's grandson Jeff in The Guns of Will Sonnet, Steve Jacoby in All My Children, cousin Jack Ewing in Dallas, and Grant Harrison in Another World. At the age of 52, Dak Rambo died from complications associated with AIDS on March 21, 1994. The American character actor James Robert Rebhorn appeared in over 100 films, television shows, and plays. Among his most notable roles was in the 1996 film Independence Day, in which he played Secretary of Defense Albert Nimzicki. The 65-year-old died at home of melanoma on March 21, 2014. The English character and voice actor John Franklin Robbins was a prolific Shakespearean actor who trained at RADA and worked at Manchester Library Theatre and Bristol Old Vic in his early years. From Ariel in The Tempest to Macduff in Macbeth, he portrayed a variety of roles. As a Canadian actor, John Benjamin Ireland won an Academy Award for his performance in All the King's Men. He became the first Vancouver-born actor to receive an Oscar nomination. In 1992, Ireland died of leukemia in Santa Barbara, California. He was best known for his role as NBC's Day of Our Lives patriarch, Dr. Tom Horton, the central cast member of the show for nearly three decades. Carey began his career in B-movies of the 1940s, 1950s, and 1960s. As a result of his contributions to television, he has received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame at 6536 Hollywood Boulevard. The actor, director, manager, and author Sir Michael Scudamore Redgrave won Best Actor at the Can Film Festival for his performance in the Browning version. On March 21, 1985, Redgrave died from Parkinson's disease in a nursing home in Denham, Buckinghamshire. An American actor, Pierre Linda Lapp was also known as Peter Brown. In the ABC Warner Brothers Western television series Lawman from 1958 to 1962, he played Deputy Johnny McKay opposite John Russell as Marshal Dan Troop and from 1965 to 1967, he played Texas Ranger Chad Cooper on NBC's Laredo. An American actor and singer of Broadway and cinema, Robert Preston Meservey was best known for his collaboration with composer Meredith Wilson and for originating the role of Professor Harold Hill in the musical The Music Man and its 1962 film adaptation, in which he was nominated for his first of two Golden Globe Awards. In 